Well, good morning, you two. It's Saturday morning, and there's one yard sale today, or one estate sale in the paper, and we just pulled in. We got little Rennie. You say hi, Rennie. He's going to guard the car, and we're going to have a good time. If you're into it, we're going to go take a look and see what's going on. So let's do this. All right, Rennie, you watch the car. All right, good old M&E. Look at the looks of it. Is that what they are? Car bumpers? Oh, it's battery. It's a battery. I like these boxes. Bunch of cool little speakers. Heat sink. Bulbs. full-on bike kit that's fun Timer. It's a bell. Oh, was it a timer? Yeah. Twist the bottom. Know. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. See if it works. Yeah. yeah. How much is it? Nice. Sandy.
tube tester. Oh, that was fun. $30 we spent, and that includes this cookie. Thank you. All right, let's go home and check it out. All right, here we go. Got everything unpacked and lined out for you. Let's take a peek. I'm going to flip you around and we'll see what we got. All right, first up, we got a nice, nice handmade box. Look at this baby. Someone uh, really put some love and care into this box. It's perfect for a lantern box. Uh, I think I think uh, someone was making like a power tool box because this guy was in it. And I'll show you what that does. This is a little homemade um, cord manager, right? See the little, little core right there. You wrap all your your extension cords in it, and that went inside this this little tool chest right there. Picked up this. Let's see. I needed my glasses. It is a Vickers. Vickers vein pump. I think it's a hydraulic pump. And uh, it's got it's got nice action. It's clean. I think uh I think I might do pretty well. Uh I'll get that listed up and get that on its way. Got a nice little uh grinder. And uh, I've already put some uh, beans in there and it actually grinds up real nice. It actually is a good grinder. It works. I'll set this out of our way Pick this Mercoid control uh, Switch it's a pressure switch and uh, I looked that up these go these go fetch a pretty good uh, Pretty good penny. There's a mercury switch in there. I don't know if you can see it in there. See it wiggling back in there? That's pretty cool. Ah, I grabbed this little floodlight changer. I've got a use for that. Uh, I, that's nothing special, but I needed it. And let's see, what else do we have here? Cool little headlamp. I got this because there's no rot in this. It's got a belt loop on it. And uh, it, it puts out, I think it puts out 9 volts or, or maybe even 12 volts. So uh, we'll see if we get this, this lamp working and see what happens. Otherwise, I could use the battery pack and the cord and I could uh, energize something else that I might have. So I thought that was kind of neat to have around. I did not pay $15 for this. In fact, I paid 30 for everything. Everything that we got here, I paid 30 today. And... Uh, it was a um, discount day. Plus, I know the guy do, do, does real good. He, he really helps that helps me out. Um, let's see, trailer Kelsey trailer. It's a brand new. Oop, yeah, sorry about that. Brand spanking new. This is a nice one. That's all metal. It's a trailer brake. Look at that baby. That's a nice one. It's got all the accessories, it's got the brake line tubing, the whole works. So I'll get that listed and up and out of here. Okay, get these three, these three items right here, these are epic uh, anchor items, these guys right here. It, it's not going to, it's not going to um, surprise me if I get as much as 200 for this and maybe even a hundred for this but 
even if I got um, two fifty for these three items, we'll we'll just see how that goes. Uh, everybody knows how I like cassettes. Uh, I picked up all these brand new uh, high bias. This is a this is a high bias uh, TDK, and then what I get six um, high high bias XS2 Scotch. So that's a nice little stash of 90 minute cassettes. That's a real nice uh, pickup right there. I love it. All right? Yeah, Mickelson Rat Tail File had to have that I don't think I, I don't think I have but maybe one of these and it's kind of worn so I grabbed that I also have this demagnetizer uh, I got to figure out what what this does what this is what it's for up oh, this is a little China it's a little it's a cute little deal it's got a nice cover for it a screen and okay, let me see it's very odd it has the spring Right, it has this little structure down here, which I would assume. What is this? Let's go on the outside. Okay, I see. And then keep this buckle and this buckle that keeps this down. I don't know why it's spring loaded. And I, I imagine you put your parts cleaner in there, and then uh, when you're done. You stow it away. So, it's a pretty cool little thing. I could definitely use that when I'm doing my lanterns. Get that out of our way. Interest. This is <laughs> this is an interesting score. A friend of mine was at the actually at the sale, and uh, he handed this to me. He says, "Hey, I needed this. This is right up my alley. This is a phone time." register company portland oregon and uh it's a uh, sand dial and it it works so i you know I, I maybe this was something in the co um uh, something they needed to measure something but you can see it's filling up down there look at it go and uh it's old school so, um, I don't know, I'll have to look that up and see what that goes for. This is a Marine Toolbox Dry Pack. It's just like a little heavy duty um, storage container. I think I actually will put that in my boat. And this I thought was really cool. Someone paid decent money for this. This is not a cheapo Harbor Freight. It's got a nice Set a root, it's got a root cutter there, an auger of some si sort. It's got looks like it's good steel, and the shaft is copper. Or see that? I mean, this is this little thing is it's heavy. It's no joke. Um, and I could probably put this right in a like a half inch whole hog chuck for maybe sinking a little post or a tree or something, but. Someone paid some good money for that little auger. All right, next up, little planter's peanuts bag. Thought that was kind of cute. And let's see, that's it for back there. That's all from before. This is a an interesting little pry bar. What's interesting about it is that it's light. I mean, it's not aluminum and it's not stainless. I have pry bars like this. It, all, it almost feels like titanium, to be honest with you. It's weird. It's very strange. So this will have to go back there in my stash. And got some cleaning sticks. Got a couple nice little uh, electrical leads. A little poor little piece of vice grips. There we go. Got them cleaned up and oiled up like they belong. There we go. Put those together. All right. This, I think, is a hydraulic fitting. I think it's a disconnect, almost like an air hose for uh, for hydraulic pipe. I'll bet you this is uh, a spendy little, spendy little doodad. This is a little um, old uh, bit carrier. I'm going to put matches or something in there. 
Uh, Melissa found this cool little, we didn't pay that for it, but found this little cool little timer. Um, that's pretty cool. I like it. It's an egg timer. Uh, I'm also got these little tiger snips. Cool little um, little uh, tie downs or U bolts. And this is a interesting. It's an end. What does it say there? There's definitely a mark on there, and it's got a glass front. It's all brass, so I grabbed that. That's a cool little item. Someone might be looking for that. With that, I got these rollers. I think these go up inside of a, like an I-beam for uh, making a door or something like that. I got four of those. A nice vintage, uh, what is it, Weatherhead? Weatherhead T82. That's a really nice pipe, uh, pipe cutter. Put that with these tools. These are little, I got four of them. I don't know what I'll use these for, but you can, you can tell, you can mount a rod through these. Those will be handy to have. Got this nice little compass, this PM2 Hitachi. This is a momentary, this is like uh, an industrial switch. That ought to go pretty good couple electrical leads nice little set of uh, stainless hinges no they're not stainless what are they no they're made in USA but they haven't been drilled out yet so that's kind of cool and they're heavy duty and, and compact so I've got a little box of hinges I'll throw those in there uh, this is interesting this is some sort of a jig some guy liked it he put his name in it I don't know if anybody knows what this might be for. This would be kind of cool, but this, those rollers, it's got a couple rollers, you know, and then it's got this adjuster here. It's brass. Anyway, I grabbed that. And last but not least, I got this little Mac Tools magnet. And it is, it's a strong magnet, let me tell you. Look at that. That's pretty cool. All right, I appreciate you hanging out and uh, and taking a look at the yard sale scores. I hope everybody's having a great Saturday. Stay tuned because we're going to a basketball game today. I think I've only been to a basketball game once in my life. We're not big sports people, but uh, we got some really nice tickets to go see the Blazers tonight. Stay tuned and uh, we'll show you how that looks uh, here in a few hours. Take care.